Hey YouTube, this here is an umbrella we use in our backyard. It's like a 10 or 11 foot umbrella that's cantilevered. And right now it just sits on the ground. The base is covered up by this big black ugly plastic box that is filled with sand, sandbags in there. And it holds up pretty well, but that big black box is kind of ugly. It just sits on the ground. It kills the grass and all that. Today, I'm gonna take this thing and put it in the ground and concrete it in place. So let's get to it. I did some work on this that's off camera that um, I, didn't, I didn't film, but I wanted to show you what I did. This piece on the bottom is the base that this pole here would normally bolt into. And then the sandbags would lay on these cross member pieces and the black box would fit over it. What I did was drill the bolts out, put these, uh, one foot bolts in place i'm gonna cut this thing out about 10 inches maybe 12 inches all the way around dig a hole in the ground as a foot by a foot by a foot a foot cube and put that in there and then fill it up with concrete we could use these bolts and knots just these knots in a lock knot fashion to level this out after the fact the first thing i gotta do is cut this out so i could actually put it in the ground I have some lines drawn that are 10 inches around and if I dig a hole there's a foot around that gives me about an inch worth of concrete on either side. And safety is always first but I got polynet, polycarbonate glasses on so here we go. I'm gonna put this thing back together just so it is easier for me to hold and put in the ground. We'll always level it out after the fact. All right, so this is the piece that I'm gonna put in the ground. I'm gonna put it in the ground like that. And uh, with the amount of concrete I put in place, that should hold it. I'll dig that hole in the ground, about a foot deep, the concrete will come right up to the bottom of these bolts. And that'll be cast into the ground that way. And the umbrella could swivel either which way. So let's go ahead and dig a hole. All right, there's the hole with the post in it. Now we just gotta fill that up with concrete right up to the bottom of the bolts that's in there because we wanna use those nuts to level this thing once it cures up.
well I probably could have done with a, another inch or so of concrete but this is 260 pound bags worth of concrete now the only thing to do is let that dry I have a little bit of grass so I'll fill that back up and then once it dries and cures up we could come back and level this post out and uh, see how it works all right here's one more shot of this thing before i pack it up until another week i have the grass that came out of there so i'll just pack that around those bolts are stainless so they should be good in there for a few years and then uh we come back and level it out in a week maybe a few days check and see how how well it's cured up all right we'll see you in just a, a couple days it's been a couple days now since i've put this in the ground and it's fairly steady now i'm gonna level this thing up I'm going to use the bottom nuts to level this thing up and the top nuts to tighten it down. And I'm just going to use my phone with a bubble level on the top to figure out when I have it leveled. All right, hopefully you can see that there's a little bubble level there with a bubble in the center of the circle. It's almost level, it's level enough really. So I'm just going to go ahead and tighten this thing down now and then recheck the level. If you could see that, you see that it is pretty much dead level. Let's go ahead and tighten that up now. This is tightened up and then once again, the bubble is in the middle. So now we need to put the umbrella on there. For this little extra space on the concrete there, I'm just gonna replace the grass that came out of this hole right on top of there. All right, and there we have it. Here's the umbrella. The only thing left to do is to put a little bit of grass on there and clean this thing up. Only time will tell, see how this thing holds up. I hope you like this video. If you do, please hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up and we'll see you on the next one. God bless.